here at World Dairy Expo, day two, and we have with us Cheryl Moan stopping by from Uttertech. Cheryl, step on up to the microphone. How are you doing there? Yes, I'm doing just fine. We had now, a, well, what's Uttertech? Uttertech is a company that manufactures fabric items for dairy producers. And we started out with one item several years ago, and now we've grown to a 34-page catalog. Wow. And next year will be your 20th anniversary, right? That is correct. Yeah, it's, I'm not getting any older, but I guess I've been here for 20 years. So, so how did how did you get started in the clothing business? Do you have a dairy background, or? Yes, mm. yes, we do. Um, my husband and I had a dairy for 30 years. We no longer have our cows. We sold them three years ago. But yeah, a lot of our products came by need for myself. And then as I entered the marketing, you know, our products, then customers began to tell me what they wanted. When I stopped by your booth, I noticed a variety of products. What seems to be the top seller? You know, um, our bibbed overalls have really taken off, and I think because there's so many people, not only in the dairy industry, but people, not only dairy farmers, but other people in the dairy industry that are using them, um, the breeders have found it's really nice to have a pair of bibbed overalls where they can peel off all that dirt and manure. Uh, veterinarians are using them as well as nutritionists that are going on farms and doing body scoring. So it's not just the dairy producers now that are buying our bibbed overalls. Um, it's the breeders, the, you know, it's, it's the whole gamut of people that work in dairies that are finding our product to be really helpful. You get your ideas from the dairymen and dairy women out there. I'm sure they give you some ideas on what you want, and then you go ahead and make it, huh? Right, exactly. And we never end up with a first prototype as the final prototype. So we start with an idea and, and develop something, and then we always end up tweaking it a little bit. So, But, yes, that is where most of our ideas come from. Is the chaps, is that something new? It is. Yeah. The waterproof chaps. Um, we have customers saying, I don't want to put my boots through the pants and get them dirty, and I don't want to take my boots off. So what do you have as an alternative to that? So the chaps are a new product this year, and they're beginning to gain some popularity where they buckle in the back, and you don't have to take your boots off in order to get them on. So, so recently uh, you added pink to your product line. Uh, it seems to be popular these days. It is. Pink is a very, very big um, a big thing in most industries, not just in the dairy industry. And so um, we've thought about it for probably two or three years. And last year at World Dairy Expo, we launched the pink. Uh, we just had a sample and we took orders. And so we had several orders. So when the fabric came in, we were, you know, we had customers waiting. So this is our first World Dairy Expo with pink in our line. And it really is making our booth pop. Popping with pink. Popping with pink, So yes. uh, you can order online your products? Yeah, we have a very user-friendly website, and I keep telling customers that stop in the booth this week, too, we answer the phone. You're not going to get a prompt, so um, if you have a question, just give us a call. All right. What's your website? It is uttertechinc.com. Uttertechinc.com. Mm -hmm. All right. Cheryl Moan with Uttertech. Thanks for joining us. All right. Thank you.